It's the simple things. Don't drink that water, Jet. Yeah, don't. That's not It's just little things like this that make the trails fun. We're going to be doing the red and yellow trail today. We're in Folkestone, Georgia, and it's the part of the Ralph E. Simmons State Forest. So all together, I believe that'll be close to about three, three and a half miles. <laughs> Happy New Year. You know, it's the American Hiking Association's first day hikes. We are partici sure. participating. Yeah. Daddy wasn't prepare his dad jokes and I did. Well, I'm older and wiser now look, look. since last year. Look, Wesley, you're not a dad. Mm -hmm. I know, but I still have those in my mind all the time. What so we're actually at the Ralph E. Simmons State Forest. Uh, we actually had to cross the Florida line, but the address they told us was in Folkestone, Georgia. So we're going to check out what the state forest has to offer. Right? That's right. Right. You just stepped in poop, step Mr. Dion. Did he? Yeah. yeah that's he, where the pest control comes from. He's not on the other shoe. Oh, yeah. He just stepped in a... Yeah. Oh. Well, yeah. He can wipe it off. He can yeah. walk it off. Yeah. Happy New Year. Oh, I can smell it, too. I can... I'll catch up. Yeah. We've got a caravan today. Look at all those churvin. <laughs> Hello, Jessica. Hi. Dion's still uh, trying, Hello. trying to uh, get the poop off his shoe boots. He's doing fancy moves. He moves like Jagger, though. He moves like Jagger. If Jagger had poop on his boots. So, like I mentioned, it is first day hikes with the American Hiking Association. Now, granted, I just found out about that. I'm new to hiking. Um, I would have done this anyways, but knowing that it's actually part of an initiative, that's pretty cool. Oh, we're doing the yellow and red trail at the Ralph E. Simmons State Forest. Sir, how, how's your uh, boots? Yes, it's uh, still on there. <laughs> we'll get it. We'll, we'll, we'll get taken care of. Anything it'll defend us from the wild animals. <laughs> Always got to have something fun happen in the video, right? They say when you encounter wild animals, or even just as a preventative measure, when you're walking or hiking alone or just hiking in general, you should try to make noise. Well, when you have a caravan of children, I don't think that's going to be an issue today. I like how it's how open it is. Yep. Yeah. Country in a way far behind. Not too bad. Ooh, I'm seeing some red markings up there, so maybe this is where we connect to the red trail. Yeah, maybe this is where the yellow trail ends and the red trail begins. Yes, and what we're planning on doing is connecting to the red trail, looping all the way around and connecting back to the yellow trail. Those trees are pretty cool. Oh! Look at the Spanish moss.
Lexi? Mm -hmm. I know, uh, besides all the craziness, your thoughts of the trail? Um, so I want to see a snake, but I haven't found one yet. Yeah. I'm going to be really disappointed if we, if we like, go back and like, we don't find a snake at all. Mr. Dion, I wanted to get your thoughts. I really like the way it's taking us through the power lines. It looks kind of post-apocalyptic. Yes. Go to the thumbnail. You can cool. I said we were going to Oh. Now, huh. There's, okay, so yeah. I guess that takes you somewhere. Yeah. But that's not the way it's telling us to. The no, but it, it's telling us to keep on going this way. So we're going to go yes, this way. Come on. Now, I saw pictures of this on the Alt Trails app as far as, um, pictures of other people having done the trail so this was kind of cool but feels different when you're actually out in it we're off to Oz we're off to the Emerald City in Oz Emerald City in Oz yep Ian says we're off to the Emerald City in Oz we're walking through the power lines guys we're walking through Oz something no, like I'm, that I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure uh, Back in the day, they didn't have power lines. Yeah. Some may argue that it takes away from nature. I don't think so. I think it's kind of cool. It's different, anyways. It's different that we're walking in Oz. We're not in Oz. Your, your thoughts of the power lines? Um. They look powerful. Yeah. I wonder who planted them. So we did see a snake, or I did see a snake for half a second, and it already kind of went off it back into the brushes. Um, as we tell everybody, it's just you leave them alone, they'll leave you alone. Yep. Watch your steps. It's the biggest thing teaching children about hiking is watching where you're going. It's a unique trail. If you were in the Folkestone or Hilliard, Florida area, heck, if you're in, you know, Nassau or Camden or anybody looking to just do something different, uh, as far as popular trails in the area, it's all usually centered around the Okefenokee, but this is kind of a little side thing. It's part of the state forest. A lot of people may not even think about this as an option to walk. So just make sure you look it up. It's the Ralph E. Simmons State Forest. All right, so we just ran into some other folks hiking and walking their dogs. Uh, they advised us that this will take us up near by the river, which is the direction we were going anyways. They did encounter a snake, but just like I said, watch your step. I think one of them was a husky. <laughs> they did have some huskies, yeah. So we did confirm, Mr. Dion, through some other hikers, that this is the St. Mary's River. <laughs> All right, we're going to test our Indiana Jones skills. How about you? <laughs> um, is it drier on this side? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I think we're going to be good. We did it. Obstacle course. Me? And oh, yeah, look at that. More obstacle course. Me I'm thinking. Success, I named for us. You did? Team. Try to look for the driest spot. Ew. Look to your left. Um, the floor is lava, Ian. The floor is lava. <laughs> oh, you got it? Sorry. Jay, you survived, I think, Ian. Me and Jay picked the name for each other. That's our team. What did you the pick? Sweaters. The sweaters. Yeah, we can oh. be sweating. Yeah. Like this. We're sweating to death. 
one of my favorite things to find is flowing water. So check this out. Just a little kind of things that make trails worthwhile. It's the simple things. Don't drink that water, Jet. Yeah, uh -huh. It's just little things like this that make the trails fun. Coming across these little streams. Any kind of flowing water is what motivates me. Looks just like the Shawnee River water. Yeah, it does, but I think this is just because this is muddy. You're taking it home. Uh, water's getting like Shawnee. Do not pour it on yourself either. Imagine if we forgot that it was water. It wasn't water. Oh, oh wow, good job. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting on? You're watching the video right now. Go right underneath, hit subscribe, and you'll see all of our family fun videos, including our friends. We go on lots of little adventures. So join us, please. So then why don't you tell them? And while you're still there, why not just go subscribe to my channel, Lex Pineapple. You heard it. Look at the incline. This is kind of neat incline. It's like a, I don't know what you call this. There's, there's not mountains in this area, but it's a hill. This is neat. Hill your mountains. <laughs> this is pretty unique. We're on a hill. There's an incline. It's actually pretty continuous. Oh. Big old mountain ant bed, watch out. Yay, obstacle. We like obstacles. All right, we're looping around here. I don't envision we have too much left. Um, but in later videos, I would like to, you know, like, you know, see what's down there. Oh, yeah. Guys, we've enjoyed walking out here to Ralph E. Simmons State Forest. We found the trail on all trails. And then I just kind of started researching it from there. I think it was a good selection. The variety of scenery. Make sure. Check it out. We'll see you on the other side. <laughs>